Last week was special for us as Annika turned two years already. We were still in Bangalore on the eve of her birthday, but had planned her party for a go. Happy to you! It's quite a long drive from Bangalore to Goa, so on the way we decided to spend one night at a small resort in Hubli, where they had a water park for children. We thought all the swimming and water slides would get Annika into a great mood for a beach holiday. Bad. Bad. It's not good, it's bad. Achane. Water. Water. It was spilling water on Annika. But little did we realize how enormous and scary the water park adventures might be for a small girl, even as brave as Annika. And she was terrified of the pirate themed park. Annika likes a lot. I think at least like I think at least you got to enjoy two minutes of her being really happy about this. But I was running for the camera, so I didn't see her at all enjoying this. That's the skull there. Bad, bad skull. She was so scared that even the next morning she couldn't stop talking about the bad pirates. Anika? Oh. Anika, see? Is it your happy to you, Anika? Anika? Mm, pirate is Gusha, Anika. So she did not start her birthday in an excited mood, but we needed to start driving towards Goa anyways. And then we got to leave the scary pirates behind us. Now we are driving from here to uh, towards Goa and Annika's very very special birthday surprise. Annika, happy to you! At least we will get to enjoy some pretty magnificent views because we will be driving uh, through the central Goa and the jungles and waterfalls there. So Annika will be getting quite a nice birthday. She's giving her most serious face. <laughs> Annika, smile, photo. <laughs> Annika. The drive from Hubli towards the coastal Goa turned out to be a terrible experience for her as well. Our poor baby was not having a good birthday so far. Oh, it's been quite a rough birthday. Morning for Annika Bisa. She uh, has been having a lot of car sickness lately. She like, did a huge vomiting session on our way here. That's why we have both changed our dresses. But we're taking a quick break now before we head to our destination. And we have arrived to the Goa International Airport to pick up a special birthday gift for Annika here. It's arriving all the way from Finland. Forward. This is departure. Arrivals is forward. Oh. <laughs> Annika! <laughs> After a long wait, Annika finally got her daddy for a visit to India and she did not come without lots of gifts. Annika's first reaction was absolute excitement, but she was quickly so overwhelmed by all the emotions and the exhaustion from the drive that she didn't quite know if she should hug or run away from daddy. But it didn't take her long to warm up to daddy and pretty soon they became best friends and were sharing ice creams together. Annika, it's your birthday. What do you want? Happy, happy birthday. Birthday, yes, it's your birthday. Annika, birthday. Birthday. Ice cream. We reached our homestay quite late in the afternoon, and after settling down, it was already starting to get dark. We had ordered Annika a birthday cake from a local pastry chef, keeping in mind all of Annika's favorite things. And we were so excited to finally sit down at the table for Annika's birthday dinner, crowned by this cake made specifically for her. 
with all the eagerness to finish Annika's birthday on a better note. We didn't quite realize though that Annika would be so zapped by the travel, sickness and excitement that she would immediately fall asleep as we sat down at the table. So I think this little girl is going to grow up into quite a party girl. Like what? It's, like 7:30? <laughs> eight. it's eight but i think she has been asleep already for half an hour now i just was able to move her on the on the table it's like party hard sleep early yeah. so we did what all good parenting advice would suggest and postponed the cake cutting for the next day and <laughs> ate the cake for breakfast which, to be honest, wasn't such a bad idea after all. But it was a beautiful morning by the riverside in a quaint little village in Goa. Annika was so happy about the flowers and butterflies on the cake and of course she just loved all the chocolate. <laughs> if we can't make exceptions, spoil the kids a little and throw the parenting rules out the window, even on birthdays, then when can we? Annika? Annika is eating A? Wow Annika! <laughs> Annika you had A! <laughs> ah. no. No, Annika is just Nika. Nika. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Annika is celebrating her birthday in the morning, Annika. Mm -hmm. Usually people <laughs> have it in, in the evenings, Annika, at happy night. Happy to you. Happy, Annika, to, happy you. to me. Happy, happy to, to you. Happy to me. Um. Oh. Annika is eating so <laughs> big cake, Annika. <laughs> Our happy morning celebrations continued as Annika got even more gifts so when she received there, yeah. dozens of books from our hosts in Olaulin, a Finnish Goan couple who had a suitcase full of old Finnish children's books from their own children to give to Annika. It's a never-ending birthday for Annika. Surprises! <laughs> I think it's safe to say that even Annika, though donkey. Annika's birthday didn't get off to a very good start. We did finish it on a great note and made it into a memorable birthday for her. Well, this is only a short update on her birthday. I'll be posting a longer video of all our go and adventures with Annika and her tati a few weeks from now. Hello. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Annika, show it to Tati. Tati, Tati, Tati.